Hey y'all, welcome back to l and Honeycomb Homestead. Today is a beautiful day. It's in the 80s right now. <laughs> right now. And I'm out here getting some more cucumbers. As you know, this daggum cucumber tree is thriving, thriving. And I just can't wait till the fall get here. So that way we can sit here and pick some more vegetables and everything. So if you want to just stick around again and see what I'm doing out here, stay tuned. As you know, it's been raining, it's been storming. I didn't video it, but you see that cucumber? Um, it's just been really, um, really coming down out here and it cooled things off. But as you know, in the south, when it rains, it does not stay cool too long when it's summertime and it rains and it gets hot again. So I'm gonna go ahead and harvest some cucumbers and then I'm gonna take you around um, in the garden and show you what's been going on here lately. All right, so I'll be back. I told you, there's a lot going on after that rain. I was able to get up some squash um, in there and I was able to get a couple of those green tomatoes. I go ahead and get them because I do not want nothing to be chomping on those. So I'll have that in a, a recipe as well. I got two of these and then I had a ripe one that was red. I went on and got those. But like I said, there's a lot of cucumbers still producing. That means there's more flavorful snacks and you can never have enough cucumbers because that's just more stuff going up on the shelf and I'm very grateful and very pleased about that. As you can see, the carrots are still thriving. I can't wait. It won't be long before I start harvesting them. I was able to harvest some sage from the other day and got them done. And there's nothing going on in the pool, as you know. I will be putting stuff in there and I will be putting stuff off in this bed. And the little volunteer tomato that I was sitting here working on just an experiment and see what it would do. She looks good too. <laughs> she looks good too. So as you know, everything's going good at the honeycomb. The chickens are doing well. They're still doing their little thing. Mickey's still doing his little thing. And I was gonna show you what Mickey looks like because the last time y'all saw Mickey, he was looking rough. But he's looking good now and I'm so pleased that he's back to his old self. And I'm gonna show you what he looks like. I'm gonna turn the camera around. Mickey, look, say hi to everybody. Say hi. <laughs> Mickey's doing good, y'all. Mickey is doing good. And um, the chickens as well is doing good out here too. And I'm so ready to get these beds ready. But they doing good as well. They're over there in the little area. But they doing good too. So I'm gonna go out here and do some work and um, clean that whole walkway. Yes, I did get those windows up. <laughs> it has been too hot, y'all. I just did not want to come out here. But um, yeah, everything looks great out here. And I'm just so pleased everything is looking better than what it used to be. And um, so I'm gonna get this cleaned up and everything. And um, yeah, everything looks good. Chickens are looking good. They're doing their thing over there. And uh, move y'all up a little closer. They doing pretty good. They're eating and doing their little thing over there. And um, Mickey's doing well too. So if you all like this video and what was going on over here at the Hank Kong, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. And y'all stay cool, stay hydrated, and have a wonderful, blessed day. Bye-bye.